Hey guys, what's up? Happy hump day. Um, does anyone get tired of hearing that hump day? Yeah, I mean, it is Wednesday, but yes. Um, I love getting to the middle of the week. Uh, anyways, hi guys. Well, after a crazy couple of days traveling and getting home to a really crazy situation um, within the school district, I am happy to like have that all behind us and be moving forward. So I wanted to hop in because today I want to chat about the value of what you're getting in all the things. I was thinking a lot about this over the course of the weekend, Sunday in particular, because I was finishing getting everybody ready for my five day find your fit group. This is kind of the roll off of my March Madness group where I designed a workout for the group based on program variety. And I really loved the feedback that I got from it. It was a lot of fun to see people trying new workouts or revisiting workout programs that they hadn't done in a while. So I ended up deciding to form this five day free group because it doesn't cost anybody anything to participate and everybody gets the ability to try the Beach Body On Demand platform that my husband and I use every day for our workouts. Um, I did some sampling for people who were interested in just trying some nutritional support, um, particularly when it comes to superfood support and pre-workout support, which was, you know, um, you know, it's a big deal for me because I want people to get a taste for everything. So I was thinking about what it took to put this group together because I get asked all the time, how much you know time and work do you really put into coaching? And some days, like today, it's probably been all of 15 minutes with the exception of my 20 minute workout because all I've really had time to do is jump into my groups, check in, see how everybody's morning was going for those who work out in the morning, post our workout information and kind of how the day's going and that's it. But on Sunday, because this group is so important to me and I want to make sure that every single person that's in it had their own customized five-day workout plan if they wanted nutritional support that I could give them some recipes or meal planning tips and from there just allow them to dive in to try some new things give me some feedback on what they liked didn't like and you know now we're just a few days into it but it's been remarkable to already see one, how people are embracing a digital workout program, especially for those that are skeptical or used to going to the gym, you know, have a different way of thinking about fitness than what I do and have been doing for the last five years. So it really made me think about the value aspect of what we offer as coaches. So if you're a coach watching this or you are a distributor of skincare oils or any of the amazing other things that are out there that we can all get behind now and have online businesses for, it really just comes down to the value. And that is what we try to instill on our team across all the coaches that are on our team as a network as a whole and because how many thousands of coaches do you probably follow already? How many do you, you know, really love because of, you know, the content that they share? Others are just like, oh, okay, I just kind of check in because I think that they're interesting. So as I was thinking about this, I'm like, why? You know, why was I putting so much time and effort into a group that I get nothing out of other than the chance to just connect with people? It doesn't impact me at all. Um, from a financial standpoint, it doesn't connect, you know, impact me at all from a growth standpoint for my team. It just purely impacts the people who are in the group. And that is what it's about. That's all I cared about was making sure that everybody who was going to join me this week felt like they really got something great out of it. So I did. I spent probably a solid I don't know, 15 to 20 minutes designing each person's program and since then you know obviously there's been a lot of follow-ups on food and meal plans and other things because it's a total package and i want everybody to understand how things work together but how there's lots of options and there's flexible meal plans there's structured meal plans there's intuitive e eating that's always a hard for me to spit out intuitive eating and there's a lot that goes into it so i guess i look at it from the standpoint of 
if I'm going to invest in myself, I'm going to spend 150 bucks. I want to get like all of my 150 bucks worth out of it. I don't care what it is. I don't care if it's a fitness program, if it's, um, you know, like a development seminar that I'm going to, it, you know, something that I'm doing for my kids to do uh, after school activity. Like I want to make sure that I get the full value because you guys, I'm super frugal. Like I want to make sure that it's like an investment that I get something out of. So when somebody works with me as their coach, it doesn't matter to me if it's a five day group or if it's a test group for a new program or whatever it is, I want you to feel like you know I'm there for you, that I can add value to your life, that you can reach out to me and I'm accessible. I am a crazy busy mom with a full-time job, just like 90% of the other people that I know and I work with. And everybody is understanding of schedules, but it is important to me. Like I am conditioned just as a professional to respond to everything within 24 hours, no matter what. And typically, I mean, the instant gratification life that we live in, it usually happens a lot faster than that. So the point of this video truly is to encourage you that no matter what, if you're working with a coach on your health and fitness journey, if you are trying to learn more about self-care and how to, you know, just take care of yourself from the inside out, if you're going to family therapy, it doesn't, it does not matter what you're doing in your life. If it's something that you're investing in to better yourself or better the situation for your family, make sure you're getting the full value out of it, you know, and reach out if you feel like you're not or have a hard conversation if you feel like you're not. I think we get conditioned a lot to just like let things go and you shouldn't do that. I mean, you it's your money, it is your time as much as it is theirs. So you need to demand that value. And the same goes for me. If I am your coach and you feel like you don't hear from me enough or you don't, you know, get the support that you that I'm talking about or that you feel like you should get, then reach out to me. You can hold me accountable to that. As long as you are working on your journey and you're putting the time in, I'm gonna put the time into you. So just think about that. Or, <coughs> stop talking so much. Um, reach out to the person who is helping you with your health, health and fitness journey and just make sure that you are getting the full value that you deserve from the investment that you are making and then go join a fun group or start a new program or do something new for yourself that makes you feel amazing because <coughs> oh, when you spend that time and that money and you put that effort in, you want to get everything you possibly can out of it, right? So hold other people accountable and go rock it out. Make yourself feel awesome. Okay. Value add. That's what it's all about right now. Talk to you guys later.